Hey guys, this is SB737 and welcome back today to another video inside of my awesome world and uh, yes, today uh, we're going to be doing some more building and I am going to first of course go and uh, attempt the slime parkour uh, and uh, oh hello, uh, hello, which which one are you? I uh, don't turn away from me, uh, hello lightning, do you want to come with me today? Alright, you could uh, you could join me, uh, but yes, uh, let's go and uh, give this slime parkour a go and see if I can do any better than usual, which is probably a no, but it's uh, it's good to at least try isn't it? So uh, here we go, uh, made the first one, actually good, good little start. Uh, so far these jumps have been uh, quite nice little jumps and then this bit is okay right we're still technically not fallen okay uh, still going uh, there we go okay <laughs> somehow I'm still going on this slime parkour okay this bit is actually not too bad which is good as well so I might uh, be able to do Ooh, that was close as well right so uh, here we go this is where I always mess it up so if I can do this then there's going to be a big progress. Come on. Oh, no. I, I smacked my beak on it. I was that close. I just cannot do that. It is doable, but I just cannot do it. I don't know why. Uh, but, uh, yeah, anyway. This, I think slime parkour is probably the hardest type of parkour uh, when it's difficult like that. Yeah, so I'm just trying to make myself sound better. feel better, really. I just by <laughs> saying that. It's, it's really the easiest, let's be honest. Uh, so there, over in the over there is the uh, the sawmill, which is what we actually built in the last episode. And uh, it looks uh, it looks quite nice. I think I, I like it. Um, so, <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's a different... I don't think everyone, anyone's ever built sawmill in Minecraft, have they? Let me know if you have. There probably is someone. Uh, right, anyway, we'll go to Freddy's Challenge Shack and get our breakfast. So, uh, good morning, Freddy. All right, and uh, what is today's challenge? Uh, use the ice farm. Ah, well, do you know what my ice farm is? You might not know. You might not know, but if we go over to our uh, our happy snow golem over here, you'll, you'll see him right there. Uh, we actually have uh, inside here, the frozen factory. And inside the frozen factory, in just a moment of silence for, uh, for Pingu, who... Uh, Sadly, passed away uh, dr in uh, drastic conditions. Um, anyway, uh, yes, we've got the uh, the super sized snow golem here, and uh, yes, uh, this is where the uh, the frozen factory is, and here is the ice farm. So uh, this actually makes ice for me, and I do have a spare pickaxe in here with uh, silk touch on it, so we might as well uh, use that. If I use this, you see, it's, uh, it mines it a lot slower. If I use my really powerful one, even though uh, this has silk touch on it, uh, I'll end up, like, breaking, like, the sandstone around it and stuff. So if I just use this, it's a lot slower, but at least I don't, like, accident, like, I don't break these blocks by mistake with by using this. So it's uh, it's definitely the safest block to use, uh, safest uh, tool to use. Uh, so what I have to do is uh, mine out all of this to uh, officially use the ice farm. I don't think I want to take all this ice with me, though, so I might just put it in a chest. But this is how you get ice really easily in Minecraft, basically. Uh, you'll have to uh, go and see. I think the frozen factory is the, the video where I uh, I actually made uh, made this. So if you want to go and see how I did it, you'll have to go and uh, search that one up. I think it was somewhere around the episode 60s, something like that. I can't remember too much. <laughs> it's a long time ago anyway. Uh, you're, you're probably watching like SB, you were so bad at Minecraft then, and commentating and everything, but I, I don't know. Uh, anyway, so I picked up all the uh, all the ice, so I'm going to put it in this chest, and uh, you'll see how much ice it actually gets me exactly 100 pieces, because it's 10 by 10, and then what I do is you flick this lever. This is the cool part, and then the water all comes out, and then did I break a block over there by mistake as well? Uh, I don't think so. Maybe that's always been broken. I can't remember. Um, I, I, oh, it's a bit of dirt. Hey, this looks tacky, doesn't it? Hey, we'll, we'll better fix this. Whilst whilst we're here, we might as well. Uh, we've got uh, we've got some sandstone because we're going to be building with sandstone today, so that's that's convenient. I don't want I don't want these tacky bits. I probably just never saw it because the the pistons were down all the time. Like if the pistons are down, you don't notice this. But we we want it to be good, you know, from behind and in front. So uh, we'll we'll put that in there as well. They're perfect, and I think now now I'm happy with it. There we go. Well, at least we got you know we got a good job out of uh, out of doing this uh, this challenge. You know, it wasn't just a waste of time doing a challenge from Fred for a change. <laughs> Right, so uh, you flick that back down, and then uh, it'll all start turning. Are you going for a snow, a uh, swim, uh, snow, uh, <laughs> lightning? <laughs> don't uh, don't let it freeze while you're in it, but it will start to freeze. Uh, we might pass by later and see if it's all uh, all done, but I doubt we'll uh, we'll get a chance to. So now uh, we'll go and get our breakfast from Mr. Fred. Uh, so uh, there he is, still in his uh, his challenge shack, and I will. Also have to go inside, I think, and uh, just check that Benji's okay, because I did sit him by the fire in the last episode, uh, so uh, I need to make sure he's still alright. So there's me, Reward Fish. Uh, thank you very much, Mr. Fred. Uh, well, I don't know why I keep calling you Mr. Fred. You're no Mr. to me. Uh, Master Fred, we'll, we'll call you, but uh, thanks nonetheless for my breakfast. <laughs> and uh, uh, so go in here and just check that Benji is okay. He's, he's, he should be by the fire if he's uh, if he's still there. Let's have a look. Uh, yep, oh, look at him. He's, he's warming up. We left him out in the snow all episode, last episode, in the snow and the ice, so he's trying to warm up, aren't you, Benji? Are you enjoying that? I hey, didn't see me, did you? <laughs> Enjoying that. <laughs> right, well, I'll leave you. I'll leave you there for now. Uh, but let's uh, let's go over. So uh, today we're actually going to be building the inside of the pyramid, and it's going to be like the, the catacombs inside. I think uh, I think that's what you can call the inside of a pyramid. Uh, so that's what I'm calling it anyway. The, the catacombs. And uh, yeah, so to do this, we're, I did build my pyramid. 
a long, long time ago. We're talking like episode 54, I built my pyramid. That's over 100 episodes ago, but I haven't done, never did the inside. Um, <laughs> I just became something I never got around to doing, but it would definitely be a lot better if it had some inside. So you can actually go in it and, uh, and make it a little bit more interesting, isn't it? So uh, that's, that's what I'm doing. Does this redstone still... I feel like this is a bit broken, this redstone. It doesn't seem to work, does it? No. So what I'm going to have to do is maybe go, go at it from the outside. So I think it's the second one along will take me to the pyramid. Hopefully I get on the right one. I do need to fix this at some point, this uh, redstone. Like the first one does work. Then the second one doesn't, which is a bit strange. So I think it's this one. Uh, so as long as I go to the right place. Yeah, this is the right place. So uh, to the pyramid we go. Uh, hopefully lightning can uh, can catch up with us. Uh, I don't know where he is. I can't see him uh, running behind the distance. He'll, he'll probably m reach us at the end of the episode. That's probably what's going to happen, isn't it? <laughs> right. Uh, so uh, right the way along we go. So I have kind of done a little bit of the inside of the pyramid just to make it, um, just so, you know, so we actually get it done in this episode. Otherwise, it would take me like five episodes to do everything there. <laughs> it took me ages. Took a lot of sandstone, but thankfully I was in the desert. So uh, getting sand isn't too bad. I usually get sand from the other desert though, but like kind of, you can get a little bits without people noticing but generally speaking I like to go to the other desert to take sand and this one is kind of the one where I, I build stuff in even though I've, I've only ever built the, the pyramid in it <laughs> uh, so yeah what I've done is I've, uh, I've got smooth sandstone and I've done like the inside if, if you can see so this is inside. There used to be mobs spawning here, so I also lit it up a bit. There'll probably be mobs in the walls, but I kind of like the idea of that because it's like it's more haunted, isn't it? Because uh, it is called the Haunted Pyramid uh, back in its day. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be building some uh, some stuff in here. And uh, if we just go uh, through here, so there's going to also be some like passageways around. They're not going to be too extensive. I might make them longer uh, in the future. Uh, but like you, the passageways, you can look over from here and everything and uh, and have a see. So uh, whilst we're here, we might as well actually get started on this passageway. So uh, I'm going to get out. Uh, maybe the pickaxe can come. And if I put uh, these on here, man, it's a little bit tricky to place, but I think I've managed it. There we go. So we'll put some stairs on there, and then on the side of the stairs, uh, we'll put some slabs. And uh, and then I think what I'll do is maybe like uh, if I put uh, like a like a board away around the uh, the top of here like that and then uh, get some uh, some stairs upside down ones and put them side uh, either side like that and then even go either side of here and put some uh, some stairs on there uh, you kind of see it's kind of meant to be like a little like you know opening in the wall almost and there's going to be one one there and one there as well and uh, you'll see and then if we actually uh, get out the flint and steel and uh, set it alight it almost works as well it does work as, uh, as like lighting for the uh, the room as well so uh, I think it, it looks good uh, to appreciate it we have to uh, look like see it looks kind of cool doesn't it I think you got to say it does look cool uh, so I'm going to jump down here now and uh, do we do the other one whilst whilst we're at it we might as well do the other one um, and uh, the, there's a, you know the third one at the like at the back of the room that side of the room uh, you'll be able to see it when we, uh, we look out actually I don't know if there's actually no way to get over there, so I don't know how I'm going to do this one. I'm going to have to build up to uh, to get to that one, I think. Uh, so if we just get this, this one's always the trickiest stairs, uh, but if we can manage to get it down in one piece. There we go. I think I think we did, so that's that's good. And then I know what I'm doing for this one now, so it's a, it's a bit easy. I wasn't 100% sure on the first one, like exactly where everything placed, but once you do it once, you know, you do get into it. How did, that, how did I manage to place the slab on a block that doesn't exist, basically? <laughs> All right, let's see. There we go. That's better. And then uh, we'll put that upside down slab there. Oh, oh, no, that's in the wrong way around. Oh, oh, I forgot. Yeah, I'm back to the powerful pickaxe now. Did I actually put the other one back? No, I've got I've got two pickaxes on me now. <laughs> I need to remember to put it back because I've, I have that there for a reason so that if I ever don't have a silk touch one, I can still uh, get ice. And I should probably uh, not set this alight until I've actually, uh, well, when I need to walk on it, basically. <laughs> uh, so we'll come onto this side and do the same. There we go. And uh, then we'll light this up as well. So that's uh, that's that. Perfect. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll jump down and have a little bit of a look. So I'm happy with uh, the way uh, both of them are, are now looking. And uh, we might as well uh, build up onto this one as well. So uh, I might as well just, yeah, I'll just use sandstone. Uh, that should uh, that should be okay. I don't know why I went to the other side. But anyway, we'll uh, we'll build up to the top with sandstone and then uh, get this uh, this final one done. Then, then it's done, dusted out of the way, and I don't have to worry too much about these walls. There is another thing that needs to uh, be done on these walls, but uh, we, don't, we, don't, we don't think about that yet. Uh, well, if I mine these away as well, uh, just so they're, uh, they're out of the way. And then what I'm just going to put a, uh, a slab here, if I can reach. There we go. And a slab there. And then, uh, yeah, put the... Oh, no, no, that's the wrong block. <laughs> get mixed up. Is that many uh, different sandstone blocks in my inventory? Uh, it's, I'm going to get mixed up. I've got smooth sandstone as well to uh, to top it off. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, now all we need to do on this bit is get the stairs. And then what we're going to do is we're going to do the, the interesting bit. The, probably the best, uh, the best bit. 
of the of the the catacombs uh, we're actually going to be building like a big like sphinx like uh, statue you know like a, a big gold one you'll see i've got i've got 10 blocks of gold which is 90 pieces of gold which is quite a lot of gold when you think about it so i don't have much left uh, but i have like i have a lot like i don't really need to use gold that much you know because uh, i don't like other than powered rails really because i don't really make golden apples because i don't really use them in, in this world so i had lo a lot of gold to spare but still i had to part of it which is a little bit uh, a bit a little bit upsetting but uh, yeah we're going to be building the, uh, the sphinx it's going to have gold going to have purple it's going to be uh, built out of just normal sandstone as well I've got to remember that. And so uh, what we're going to do here is uh, going to come across four like this. And uh, this, this was seven along. Then that's four. And then uh, on this bit, uh, we're also going to do uh, the same on this side. And uh, it's kind of, I don't know if I'm going to get this right, but it's kind of, I suppose it's going to be pretty much the same, to be honest. So I, can, I can't really get it wrong, can I? And then what we do is we, uh, we pull out the slabs and uh, we're going to build these uh, right the way. And look at that, a skeleton has managed to spawn the, the pyramid. Look at that, he just whizzed past my ear, did that, uh, that arrow there, didn't it? And uh, then uh, for here, we're going to just do, oh, uh, we're just going to do two more. So, uh, oh no, wait, wait, we want to first put that on there and then put two more along there. Perfect. He hasn't hit me yet. You're not very good, are you, skeleton, eh? You need to... See if we can hit him without him getting us once. You need to practice your target. Go on, go and get him. Oh, <laughs> you weren't much use. Oh, he dropped a bow. What, how good is the bow? The bow is pretty much broken, but at least it could could be useful potentially. I'll, I'll keep it there in case I need it. Uh, so yeah, we've uh, we've got the side bit done. And then uh, we're just going to put uh, a couple more blocks on there. And then what we'll do is we'll do the same on the other side with the uh, the other one. So uh, same sort of idea. Bring this uh, right the way. Are you all right there? Just jump in. There's probably some mobs in the walls, isn't there? Yeah, on the other side, and you're trying to get to them. Right, just, just, Lightning, just let me place this block down. All right, come on. Don't make me have to sit you down. All right. <laughs> it's like that one block that he wants to sit on, right? Once I place this down, you can start jumping around and getting all excited that there being mobs in the walls. But until I've done that, uh, just uh, just be patient, please. Uh, so, right, we're going to go on to the, uh, the next stack of uh, sandstone. And, uh, and bring that right the way along there. And then uh, we're going to go and, uh, and build one, two, three, four. And, uh, and then uh, on top of here, we're going to uh, bring the slabs. Did I get rid of that slab? No, I need to get rid of that slab because that shouldn't be on there. Uh, so there we go. We've mined that away. Uh, so... Uh, yeah, that slab comes across there, and then uh, get this uh, this sandstone and put that there, and then uh, again uh, just the same. Uh, put this. So this is this is believe it or not, this is the uh, the easy bit that is you know the kind of the the straightforward bit really. Uh, the next bit is a little bit more difficult to uh, to remember. So uh, we're gonna put them on there, and I think maybe we could do the same so I'm not sure but I know that should go like that as well uh, just to cover that up. I suppose uh, yeah, there's no harm in uh, in going like that, is there? No. Okay. Uh, so now what I need to do is get working uh, on, like, the, the head, I suppose. Uh, so uh, if we come to, I think, if we, like, the here is going to be, like, the, the bottom, like, the chest bit, if that makes sense. Uh, so it's going to be uh, that, and then it's going to come up another one, uh, like so. And then we're going to actually come out one and uh, and start working. Oh, wait, have I done this right? Hold on, there's going to be three. I think I need to go like that and then uh, put... This is, this is like one of the more complicated things I've had to do in an episode. You know, it's not just a square. It's actually like proper proper building, really, isn't it? You know? <laughs> Especially in Survivor, when you have to like look at it from the angle and be like, did I place that in the right place or not? Hmm. And then I don't want to like get it wrong either. Otherwise, I've got to redo the, uh, the whole lot. You know what I mean? Uh, so... I think I'm getting it right though, okay? Uh, so this comes along here. So this bit is going to be a six wide uh, bit of the face. And then we're actually going to have uh, another, and that's going to be four high, I think. So two, three, four. <laughs> yeah. Lining got stuck in that hole. All right, I'll leave him to it for now. So that's going to go uh, like this. And then come up one more, I think. Yeah, that's going to come up one more. So, and then that's that's like the, the bit of the head sort of done. So we'll connect this up to the wall, uh, either side like this. But then I think what I'm going to do is, um, and this bit sort of come like like that, I think. And then do the same on that. So okay, I need another stack of sandstone. But uh, yeah, bring that like that as well. And then what we can do uh, right in the middle, we're going to get out the, uh, the gold blocks. Uh, so on top, there's only going to be four blocks of gold. So uh, we're going to have one there and one there. And then uh, either side of that is going to be, oh, we'll get the purple wool out as well. Uh, so we're going to put uh, a p piece of purple wool there, a piece of purple wool there. And then uh, just above uh, this uh, is going to be two more gold blocks. So it's kind of like it's almost like a, a gold ribbon going through, if that, if that makes sense. And then uh, I guess, uh, how am I going to do this? So that's going to go like um, like this. So if, if I like connect, so it's going to do something like this, if this if this makes it. Oh, no, not like that. Uh, but hopefully this uh, this uh, makes sense. So uh, that goes across there. And then that, is, is that the same either side? I think that's how I want it to be. I think that's going to look good. I'll have to stand back and have another look at it. But I think... Uh, that's the uh, the general gist of it. Uh, so uh, we might. I think we can get down from here now. Actually, I think uh, we've done everything. So uh, is that how it's going to be? I think so. I think that's uh, that looks right. So we'll get started on the uh, the side of his head now. Okay. So uh, this bit. 
Uh, what we're going to do is uh, we can just fill it all in actually and uh, get it right up uh, connected up uh, to that and then this is going to come across like that and then that like that so there we go you can see uh, how that's uh, that all comes together and then uh, we're going to put put an ear in as well i think uh, that's the the right sort of place for the, the ear to be and then on top of that we're going to put some uh, some purple wool on okay uh, so oh I, I think i can fill this in i think there's going to be purple wool here anyway actually so that doesn't matter uh, so on top of the ear uh, there's going to be a block there a block there and then we're going to need the, another piece of gold and then uh, we're going to bring three round like like that and then uh, finally this is going to come out another one and uh, going to have that like that I think I hope I hope that's right and then uh, there's going to be gold in front of that and then uh, purple wool underneath that going right the way up to there I think that is right so you kind of see how it's starting to look like a bit of a, a, a sphinx can't you so we've got to do the same thing on the other side now so hopefully I can uh, I can get it right okay we've got to first uh, fill in the side of his head I suppose uh, so uh, yeah, so that's going to go and connect up to the back. I feel a little bit more confident now I can, I can do it. Are you all right in there, uh, <laughs> Lightning? <laughs> I hope he comes out of there at some point. <laughs> oh, I don't want him, uh, I don't want him trapped in there forever. Uh, okay, so we'll build that all, and then uh, that goes like that, and then uh, we're going to put a piece of purple wool above there, and then another purple wool, and then gold, and then purple right the way around. Oh, no, that, not there. That's I think that's actually meant to be where there's a gold block, is there? Uh, like two gold blocks like that yeah and then uh, finally the rest is uh, is pretty straightforward we can uh, just connect uh, all of that up like that perfect okay so that's like the the sides done, I suppose that's the main structure we've just got to get his uh, his face done now so uh, we're gonna I'm gonna actually if I use the less powerful pickaxe it's gonna be easier to do as well isn't it so uh, I'm gonna get out some do I have much dirt I guess I could just use uh, some sandstone and build it with that uh, so if we uh, go straight up here did I get rid of that pillar? No, I haven't yet. I need to do that as well. Uh, so what I need to do is try and put some of these behind his mouth like that. That's that's perfect. And uh, then we need to fill uh, that in. And then I'm going to put give him a bit of a nose. There we go. And then uh, we're going to uh, break that one as well. And uh, that one. And uh, put something behind his eyes like that. And like that. Okay. And then uh, finally put some fire in his eyes as well there. Uh, so Oh, no. I lost my, uh, my little block of sandstone. Thankfully, they're not uh, too precious. So uh, he should... I think be done pretty much maybe maybe like I, th I think I'm I think I'm happy with him I think I think that's how he's supposed to look you can kind of see he looks he looks pretty cool doesn't he uh, we can get a good view of him uh, from here uh, let's have a little bit of a look. So yeah, that is the uh, the uh, the big sphinx thing. I think he looks better from the side actually. You can see his nose better, can't you? Uh, but anyway, <laughs> that's that. So we have got a few other things uh, that just need to be done uh, roundabout. So. Uh, if we come uh, to here and uh, and get out the uh, the sandstone, uh, there's actually going to be I think two like this maybe, uh, and uh, two like that, and then uh, we're also going to get our, we've already got the slabs, uh, so it's going to be I should probably eat a bit of food as well. Actually, I'm starting to get a little bit uh, on the peckish side, so let's <laughs> let's eat the uh, the steak. Uh, there we go. And uh, yeah, we're going to connect this up uh, like that. And there's actually going to be lava in here. So if we put a slab on there and then a slab on there and then uh, on top of here, put two pieces of sandstone. And I think again, uh, we're going to... Oh, you're here now, Lightning. Nice of you to, uh, to join us, actually. <laughs> you haven't been here for a while, have you? You were stuck in that hole for a long time. You know, don't get stuck in another hole. Actually, we're going to be dealing with lava soon. So I will have to uh, sit you down, I think, because I do not trust you at all. So uh, how do we do that one? We did it like... Did it? Did I put some up there? I think, I think, I think this is basically how it goes, isn't it? Uh, so like that. Oh, no, wrong wrong block. I actually want to use uh, this block like that. See, it's good to use, like, a less powerful pickaxe sometimes when you're, when you're using, like, when you're, when you're working with, like, sandstone and quartz and stuff because the other one just breaks it all in an instant, whereas with uh, with a, a less a less one, it, uh, it at least, you know, you have a bit of time in between. Uh, so we've also got to do this uh, exactly the same thing here. Uh, so that's like that, that right there, and, oh, I'm just, just passing through, are you? <laughs> uh, that doesn't go there. That actually, uh, we have to leave a gap there. There we go, and uh, and then we just got to get the uh, the stairs in. So uh, one stairs there, and one stairs on here. So the final one, and then I need to fill them in with lava. It actually takes 24 buckets of lava to fill all of these in together. So quite a lot of uh, of lava to be used, and we, we haven't actually got much uh, sandstone left either, have we? So it's a good job I don't actually need it anymore, isn't it? <laughs> uh, so we'll put a bit of uh, of stairs there. And uh, some stairs there, and uh, there we go. Oh, I need to put some slabs in here. I don't think I actually did that on all of them. Uh, the reason for that is to uh, to stop the lava kind of flowing out, if that makes sense. Uh, so uh, do we need to put, yeah, some slabs there. I hope you're not in the way. You are in the way. Okay. <laughs> You'll move soon soon enough. Uh, so we'll also uh, put that on there and put that on there. And then what I'll go and do is get the uh, the buckets of lava uh, to uh, to get that finished. And there's no, there's no sandstone around. Come on. 
<sighs> if I like walk really far away, I might be able to get lightning to me. But there's always dogs that are gonna get in the way, aren't they? It's all, they always it's what always happens. Uh, let's see, how far away am I gonna have to go for him to teleport to me, though? That's the uh, the big question, I think. Uh, he's still still refusing to to teleport until there's more. You know, as long as there's mobs there, I think he's uh, he's gonna stay in there. <laughs> I'll just have to wait for him to move before I can uh, do that specific one. I'm guessing. Uh, right. So uh, what I'll do is I will put all of this in my inventory like that, and uh, I will. Uh, Keep the slabs on the hot bar because I'm going to need them anyway. And uh, then we're going to get all the uh, the lava buckets. So you can see I've uh, been busy stocking up on lava buckets. It uh, took quite a bit of time. Good old red hot shop coming in handy. Uh, right. Honestly, come on. Let's 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 stop monkeying about now. Uh, like uh, lightning. Come on. Come on. Over here. Over here. You come, please. Is he coming? Nope, he's, uh, he's staying there. I'm going to have to, I'm going to break it and then I'm going to push him out. I think that's going to be the only way uh, to do this safely, I think. Because uh, I don't want him to, to get, you know, burnt in lava. It's you! It's you! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no, 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 no. Okay, that was a bad idea. All right, lightning is now going to probably die. Um, I'm going to have to try and get him away from here. <laughs> oh, no. What did I do that for? Why did I think it would be a good idea to mine through? <laughs> right, hopefully I can lure him away. Otherwise, he is going to die. Right, there we go. Okay, stay. Stay put. Do not go near there. That is full of... Did you see the amount of mobs there? But I like it. I like the idea of there being loads of mobs behind there because it, it makes it haunted, which is what you want. But as long as they have to stay there and they can't get through to us, that's that's what I do care about. I don't want anything getting in here. Uh, right, so we're going to need the uh, the smooth sandstone to repair this. Uh, so there we go, and uh, then I'm going to need to get the uh, the other sandstone, which is here. Uh, we're going to put a block there, and then finally uh, some stairs uh, in replacement here. There we go. Uh, so I think I've completely done that now. Uh, all I need finally is the slab. So uh, we put that in there, and now what we do is we just put a bucket of lava there, a bucket of lava there, uh, a bucket here, a bucket here, and here. And finally here. Perfect. Okay, so that's the first one done. Uh, so you can kind of see uh, how it's all going to uh, go together. Uh, we'll get the uh, the next one at least started. Uh, so uh, put one there and one there, and then uh, we'll go and get the uh, the rest on. I don't need anything on the hot bar now, so we can go and get a load of other bits of lava. It just just add that extra like you know temple kind of uh, feel to it. You know the uh, the catacombs. I don't know how many catacombs you know have lava. I don't really know what like catacombs. I think is just a place for for dead people as as far as I'm know. But you know it's it's spooky. I don't know if it's the right word really. You know, but it's, it I kind of kind of fits, doesn't it? I suppose. So put that there, put that there, and uh, that there. I really don't want. Oh, 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 oh! Careful, careful, SB. Don't be, don't be stupid. Oh no! If I die, uh, right? Water. I need water. I need water. I need to not die, or I need to eat some food, or I need to do something other than uh, just stand there, just uh, letting myself burn to death. <laughs> this is the only problem we're working with, lava. Right, I'm okay. Uh, there's no water in here. That wasn't that wasn't my brightest idea, was it? I suppose uh, going in a place completely without water. Uh, right. So there we go. I'm also going to fill in uh, the lava bits here because they're, they're like that's like the safest bit, isn't it? And then uh, all we need to do is get the uh, the last buckets of lava now, and uh, we can put them in the hot bar and uh, finally finish it. So we should have eight more actually. I think when I think of it. no six more in the uh, the thing. Yeah. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, my counting skills are top notch today, aren't they? Uh, so <laughs> let's uh, let's put this one uh, in here. Uh, there we go. Uh, put one there and then put one there and then put one right here perfect okay and then uh, finally uh, just the last four going here and uh, you see I don't want to accidentally place like the same lava on the, the same block as what there's already been a, a, a lava on because then it's just a waste of lava and then I won't be able to finish the build so I had to make sure I didn't mess that up at all uh, so there we go that's that's like all of that bit finished now there is a little bit more to do which is is like going to be annoying but I'll I'll show you what needs uh, needs to be done so there's nothing in this chest. I'll just shove the uh, the buckets in. But yeah, finally, uh, we've, well, the dead bushes bit, which I'm about to do, is not annoying. You don't, don't have to worry about that. I, I don't have any trouble uh, putting down dead bushes. Uh, so <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna put a dead bush uh, here. Uh, do we put another one? Uh, I'm not gonna put one there. I'm gonna put one uh, here and here. And then finally, we just put a couple around here as well. And uh, then what I'm going to do is uh, I've got to I'm going to add some vines. But the only thing is, vines will grow everywhere unless you like block it with something like string or something. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put string right the way. So you kind of see uh, what is uh, is going to happen. So if I put string right the way along here, like this, and then and then do it on this side as well. Uh, and it's going to be the tricky bit to do actually uh, to get it all the way to the top. Uh, but you get the idea of, uh, of what what to do. Uh, can I do it? Uh, up, up, uh, there we go. Oh, did I get it? There we go. I got it. But you, you get the idea. And then what I do is if I put vines uh, right the way along here, and then I can, if I, and as, as long as I do the string traps stop, they'll just stay in line. And it looks, it looks pretty cool. I think uh, it does, it does fit it quite well. So uh, what I will do 
is that I think the best way to do it is actually to go uh, up outside here and then I can reach the uh, the rest I think from there so uh, let's uh, let's uh, let's go right the way along here and if I actually put this fire out uh, so if I go on here and place that on top of there then that on top of there and then that's on top of there and then that goes up to there and then also just got to do the same thing here uh, there we go and then what I could do is just put the vines right the way along there oh, I also need to put one there as well just to stop it growing across the roof and then uh, we'll also go in here so I'm gonna have to put out all the fire at this right now <laughs> uh, so uh, we'll put that on there like that uh, to stop anything there. Um, and then what we just have to do is just go right the way uh, down here. You can also use this trick like to, you can play, if you do this, you can place carpets on uh, on string. So you can like have it almost like floating in midair, which is also a, another cool thing. Uh, but uh, that's uh, that's another story, guys. Uh, right. Anyway, so uh, I'll just do this one, but I won't I won't do them all on camera because it's gonna it's gonna take forever and uh, it's uh, it's painful to watch. Perhaps I don't know. <laughs> so I'll just uh, I'll just do this one, and then uh, what I'll do is I'll. Um, I will do the rest off camera. So uh, we've nearly done with this one. Uh, there we go. Perfect. So I'm going to do that there. I've already done that. I'm going to do one on that bit. I'm also going to do one on that side as well. And uh, maybe like one on the back wall somewhere as well. So I'll be right back when I've uh, got all the vines in place. And now I've completely done it. And uh, I've, yeah, so I did all the vines uh, right the way around and uh, with all the string. Uh, so uh, so there you can see. And uh, I also uh, relit the uh, the fire as well that I need to. And I also added this chest right here. And I've just put uh, the remaining wool and uh, some of the vines I had in there as well. Just to kind of look uh, fancy. It's almost like a treasure chest, but it's not really that good treasure in there, is it, to be honest? And uh, yes, and I also just added some torches just to add a little bit of extra lighting. So yeah, I'm actually like really proud of this one. Like I am like proud of everything I built, but this one I thought looks, looks you know, really, really good. I can't, I'm quite impressed with that anyway, uh, as you can uh, probably tell. <laughs> uh, but yeah, if you did enjoy this video, please do make sure you leave a like. It just really shows support for the channel, and it also really helps me out. And oh, it's, uh, it's a bit dark, but the good thing is all the mobs are inside the pyramid, and not many of them anyway are outside. The Enderman is probably teleported out. Um, but yeah, also please um, uh, do subscribe if you are new around here for daily videos of Minecraft. And oh no, I've left, <laughs> I've left lightning outside. I hope he's okay. Is he okay? I've, I've, I've been a bit bad for neglecting my dogs lately. There he is. He's okay, isn't he? Uh, right, guys, as I said, thanks so much for watching, and hopefully I will see you next time.